Welcome to Sheena's Lifestyle Journey, where I talk to you about food, travel, health, and business. Today, I am sharing my food haul. Not only am I sharing my food haul, but I am sharing uh, if a family outing dinner event that took place on Easter weekend. Although my family and I don't celebrate Easter, we decided to have some time together to enjoy some food, as food always brings people, families, friends together. Today's grocery haul takes place at both Walmart and Sam's Club. Before we get into the haul, I'd like to ask that you please like and subscribe to my channel as we enjoy this haul, the first one from Walmart. Okay, so this is the Walmart section of my haul. Um, I just had to get these out of the way early and then sh and as well as share with you what I got. I haven't done um, my healthy vegan hauls yet in a while. Um, the next video that I'm going to share with you would include the healthy vegan haul. Now everything in this section is specifically from Walmart. Um, had to get up early this morning and do my Walmart pickup. I do not enjoy going in the store to shop. So that's why uh, I had to go in Anyway, let's start from the beginning. I got these Reese's, uh, these peanut butter Ritz, Ritz crackers for my husband uh, from Walmart. And then this pack of Ritz, this would be for him um, so that he can take to work. He usually eats them either as a snack or a break while he's at work. Um, he loves to have his ginger ale. So yeah, this uh, I got that for him. We got the great value seasoned fries. Uh, these golden hash browns. I love these because I get to put them in like breakfast burritos when I'm making like a veggie breakfast burrito for myself. Anyway, these um, Annie Chun's uh, bowls, noodle bowls. They're for my daughter. I got two teriyakis. One, I'm not even sure how to pronounce this, but it's called Yoki Soba noodles. Um, these, she is a vegetarian. I am a, I guess, vegetarian slash vegan. I'm not eating as healthy as how I used to before, um, but I am still not eating certain, eating meats. Uh, don't eat cheese or dairy or anything like that. So most of the stuff that I get is usually um more so in the vegetarian vegan style um types of food my son i got this ben and jerry's chocolate fudge ice cream his favorite he loves ben and jerry's i have no idea what got him into that and then we got these tunas um this these are just a dollar packets they're so easy to kind of make my husband always like when he comes home from work and i'm say if i'm working he want something quick and easy to eat and that's like an easy go to a tuna fish sandwich um here i got him these creamers for his um coffee that i got one of these days i have to show you share with you the types of coffees that i get for him we used to use like keurig a lot but i found this great great brand that's organic that's real good these uh granulated sugar this is for him to sweeten his coffee for me, no sugar at all. I either use dates or agave to sweeten anything I have. Anyway, these are some noodles that I got for myself. Um, some paper towels, two paper towels. Um, I got this immune tea. I'm going to split half of it with my daughter so she can take back to her college dorm with her. Um, and then this 
Eggo blueberry waffles I got for my son for mornings he can't figure out what he wants to eat. Um, hash browns, this is his favorite type of hash browns. So I got that for him and he eats that with eggs, um, fried eggs or scrambled eggs. And he loves these um, shredded cheese because he makes himself at 12 years old he makes himself lunch, breakfast, dinner, whenever I'm not able to do so for him. So he likes to make quesadillas, cheese quesadillas with these. Um, I got this for my husband. Not a bad price at all. It's only $4.97 for this. Okay, and I also got this. That's lens cleaners. Um, I'm going to try this type out. Normally, I buy the other kind. I think it's called Swanch. And um, yeah, I tried this one out because it's a li little bit cheaper. I wear glasses and shades, prescription lens, and just wanted to try that out for the first time. I also wanna share with you um, that I got four containers of water um, from Publix. I have two spring and two distilled. And then I got these. These are from, these are my favorite waters. If you've seen many of my videos before, these are specifically from Publix. I always try to tap into the buy one, get one free because these are pretty expensive. The size bottle of these is 1.5 liter bottles. It's a really large size, but I love it. They're spring water. It's eternal. These are specifically from Publix once again. Um, I got them for buy one, get one treat free, and I got 14 of those. I put the other... Um, 12 away uh, already, all right? So I just wanted to share those with you. I'm gonna just stay tuned for the rest of my haul. Thank you. Welcome to the Sam's Club portion of my haul. Okay, so this portion of the haul is from Sam's Club and I'm gonna share with you what I got. I got this large, um, 108 plates that's about 10 and a 16th inch um so in size for 20 dollars and something cents so this is from sam's club i got these broccoli because i have plans uh to cook do like a stir fry with um with some mushrooms and onions and potatoes i have that's what i'm gonna do with the broccoli um, shopping at Sam's Club, it is so hard to find um, organic items. Um, so yeah, this is what I ended up with. I got these broccolis. These are fresh broccolis, just pre-chopped. Um, I also got this cauliflower rice. I got it because, um, yeah, no organic whatsoever. And I love to personally, personally use organic cauliflower fry rice. Um, it's just way better to purchase organic items. However, um, Sam's Club did not have it. I love to get it from Costco. Costco is um, actually the better place, the place that I love to get most organic items in bulk. Um, but because Sam's Club is just closer to me and I just did not want to make that extra long drive, um, being that gas prices is going up this Easter weekend, I decided to go ahead with this bag of cauliflower rice. It does come with four packs uh, in it, and then um, it's very easy to cook it uh, however way you choose. This is for me. That's for me. These eggs, um, I got two packages of these. Um, Costco has the farm-raised. Sam's Club has these types, the pasture-raised um, brown eggs. One good thing about Costco, not that I'm trying to promote them, it's just that my comparison when shopping is that Costco's eggs are us usually USDA organic. Um, pasture raised is good as well as farm raised, but there's something that's, you know, pasture raised is when you allow for the birds to kind of move, roam freely. Okay. Um, this, the good thing about this is that there's no added hormones and then also here it says no animal feed so that's very good to look for um, when purchasing items especially if it's not um, usd organic slated now i got two packages of this 18 count eggs they're about six dollars and change 
Um, I got also these roasted potatoes. Um, I'm going to make that with the broccoli, as I said, that I showed you just a few minutes ago. I got two packets of those. One mashed potato. This is for my husband, family members. I got croissants for uh, these tomatoes are for myself. Didn't get the organic kinds. As you know, I love to do, I prefer organic, but what I will do is soak it at least for an hour in baking soda and vinegar. Um, got these cinnamon crunch muffin. My husband picked this up for himself. Um, and then he also picked up for himself this, um, the sausages. It says chicken, egg, and cheese breakfast sausage. So I guess they have everything in there. It says no nitrates, which is good, and no antibiotics ever. So that's good, I guess. Um, here are some onions. Love, as I said, love to get organic, but Sam's Club does not, 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 not promote a whole lot of organic items. Um, preferably BJ's and Costco's are the best places if you are a healthy, um, health conscious, that's the word, eater. Anyway, thank you so much for watch watching this, the Sam's Club portion of my haul today. Mm -hmm.